So A, I try and relate them to any real life experience that I have that could be congruent to that that feeling or that emotion or that kind of character that I need to get into. So I watch a lot of movies in order to get a lot of subtext for my character that I can use uh, on stage and off stage. Uh, research. And also a bit of, you know, feeling a bit of mannerisms from whatever I watch. And you bring all that together and yeah, you just make someone new and different on stage. Like really grasp my backstory because it helps me a lot knowing where I am from, where I come from. Uh, my social status and all that, uh, I'm supposed to bring out my character according to that. More, more of dialogues, watch movies. I do some research so that I can try and get into character. Well, I have friends and family who are in the force, so uh, spending time with them um, assists with getting into the role and also doing a, a little bit of research here and there and uh, just trying to be that person even when you're not on stage i did a little a little bit of research to find exactly uh, what it entails to be a fearless officer um, well i do research and each time i remind myself i'm not lisa but i'm the character that i'm playing on stage I think the only thing I do is research to try and understand the legal issues that are being raised within the play, the consequences they have on the characters. I try to picture myself inside the actual police station and try to see how those people behave and it helps me get into character and also assume that no one is looking at me. That a reader is a writer and a writer is a reader. So for acting, I think it goes just beyond reading the script and giving life to whichever character we are portraying, but beyond the script.